So uh, when you check the twenty twenty question five four, it's a tax planning question. Is 
reimbursement of medical expenses incurred on self and family subject to a maximum of 125,000 per month. The reimbursement policy only applies to the senior managers. You may spend the sayako for medication. A lot of employers are not reimbursed. It's the same way of saying employers are not reimbursed for medical bills. Is it a benefit? Yes, it is a benefit that is taxable, provided it was discriminatory. Like in this case, it's only covering senior managers. Totally discrimination. So you have to pay tax on him because the taxable benefit. Another point payment of his children's school fees amounting to an 80,000 per annum by the employer, the employer will not expense it in his books of accounts. If the employer does not expense it in his books of accounts, does the employer pay tax on it? Yes, he does. And if the employer is taxed, the employer will not be taxed. If I, you know, this is what it means. I've paid it as a cost as the employer. And I've paid up with it as an expense. I don't allow it as an expense in my books. That would mean if I get if I get the gross profit of like 10 million, I'm supposed to less the expenses, right? Among the expenses, to know your medical education, to know your education. And your education, yes, I've spent it, but I've not put it here. Here in the Kadash. What does that mean? In my group before tax, so I still have the 10 million. So the 1 million that I paid is part of this 10 million that I'm going to tax. So they do my 30% as the tax on that. So 30% here, 1 million paid a 400. So the employer is paying tax on that benefit. The employee will not be taxed on it. It has to be expensed in the books of the company for you to pay tax on it. Very simple. Salaries and wages are allowable expenses in the books of the employer. And that's why the employer who gets it and a particular benefit like the tax and the tax. At the expense in a manisha, like now, let me let me have salaries here or even medical. Medical medical cover. For the medical cover, I need the two million. And clearly at the expense na manisha may the come at expense and make self and make that still. And la fa part on education ya one million, like in your and cap with this. So meaning in our profit report that in our taxable profit, we shall have eight million. So we have to test the two million. We are, we are paying tax on eight million instead of ten. So we are not paying tax on the two million. Whoever is enjoying it is supposed to be taxed. And that person enjoying it is the employee. So employer at the expense. That means. He did not pay tax on that transaction. Whoever is enjoying it is supposed to pay tax on it. And that's the nature of transactions. You know, in taxation, we are not very much into expenses. We look at everything as an income. Salaries and wages, we look at it as an income. Who is earning this income? Is the employee. Is he supposed to pay tax on it? The answer is yes. Why? Because whoever paid him allowed it as an expense. So, rent and rents. To the tenant, it's an expense. To the landlord, who is earning the rent, is an, an income and is supposed to pay tax on it. Why? Because when you have a and you have tax. So, so, that will be the employer did not expense it, so it will be a taxable income. It will be an untaxable income because the employer will pay tax. The employer did not expense it. So, this annual subscription fee to the sports club amounting to 50,000 will be paid for by the employer. It's a benefit, still. 
Yeah, the question is uh, December, the pilot paper of December 2021, question 1C, page 37. You know, when, uh, when my employer pays my subscription to non professional body, you're the Raha. You're the Raha. The Kamani Raha, the Pia Tax. So, so, if my employer pays my subscriptions to Icepack because I'm an accountant, Federation of Kenya to any professional body, lawyers when when they pay for NSK, senior accountants when they pay for Icepack or whichever term you want, that one becomes a, a not taxable benefit because it encourages it promotes their profession. So, but if I'm a member of a golf club and I'm an accountant, then because my employer loves gold. And it has nothing to do with my profession. Yeah. So this one, the golf club, now we try to be a golf club. So you will be a tax. You will be required to register as a member of the Institute of Certified Public Accountants. The employer would pay the annual subscription of 18,000. That's the only tax that is professional. <laughs> Basic salary of is per annum, free housing and meals, but only for sales. Housing benefits, we pay tax on meals. Alafukumuke, the Kilwa dishes most period, most likely in the restaurant, in the hotel. Stoner, stoner. Monthly entertainment allowance, is it taxable? Yes, it is. Payment by the employer of his medical expenses, subject to a maximum of 800,000 per annum. The medical scheme covers all hotel employees. So no one will be taxed on his meal. As a government, we don't like discrimination for tax purposes. Payment by the employer of his life assurance premiums amounting 5,000 per month. You pay tax on it. Yes, you should. Employer and Apolipia insurance cover. Apolipia tax. That's a benefit is giving you to your so, when your employer pays for your insurance premiums, you should pay tax on it. When we hear Ukilipa, you should not allow it as an expense. But the total premiums will qualify for the insurance premium. Up to the maximum of 60,000. And the reliefs are calculated at what percent? 15% of the total premiums. Then uh, reimbursement by the employer of his annual subscription for the journal of certified public accountants amounting to 2500 per annum. But the employer reimburses him. Since I'm not so much with him, will you give me the sample? We can enter the invoice and the receipt. We can pay the employer and the refund. It's the employer medical. And it, so the employee is paying towards your a subscription to journal of, of CPA. That's professional. It's an untaxable benefit. The one who fully paid holiday package what one fifty thousand for his wife and children to visit him and reside at the hotel once per year. The package will also include visits by the family to neighboring tourist attractions. You pay tax on it? Yes. Did you have a So you are you are moving from Kenya to another country. For it to be a passage, it must be an expatriate. 
viajar en el despacho de su costo de violencia que ella acompaña a de la compañía casi a costo de su misión. Eso es la diferencia que vende el pichet de la compañía. Ella viene la familia. Las donas se costan con un barón que ella acaba de abrir. Eso es la relocación. You're moving from your home country to Kenya and back to visit your family or you're moving with your family to Kenya. And going back maybe home, your holiday come over there. Home seeker. Hi. So this is this, this because you're working in a hotel and the, your employer is giving you a fully paid holiday package. You're enjoying a service, the product of the employer's here. Enjoying a product of the employer. So it's more of a benefit. If its value exceeds thirty six thousand per annum, you tax it. That's now. But yet, already in Kubasana, we are not paying the tax. The whole thing. Sharia benefits in kind in December, you only exempt the whole amount if it does not exceed 36,000. But if the, if the value exceeds 36,000, you pay tax on the whole amount. So to encourage our employers, who are saying here, employees who are like anybody who are saying this, who are saying this, who are That's being so selfish. Now, Omari has further provided the following additional information. His annual average medical expenses are as follows self, wife, and children. The total average medical expenses rising for 50,000. So, the, on average, the actual expense is for 50. The medical, his consumption of the farm produce. Average of A would average about 800,000 per annum. Your evaluation should include both taxable and non taxable benefits. Use the year 2020 tax rates. Evaluate the two job offers and advise for money on which offers accept based on expected net annual income. What the examiner what the, what the expected from us in this question? And as we leave that, how much is the take home? But will it be a tax? And a party that he comes up with, he can have a dinner for his personal needs. Special advice, he lay in a much more is the best job offer. So let's compare the two. So I start with job offer A. So look at Opa A. So take a look at the employment income. Have the basic salary. The basic salary at eight sixteen thousand. So sixteen eighty thousand. What is the benefit? Sixteen. Housing benefit in Abuja Badai. So this is fifteen percent of employment income. Housing benefit for agricultural employee. Ten percent of employment income. Our employees were in it. When you see employees for farmer, ten percent employment, fifteen percent, sorry, ten percent for agricultural, fifteen percent for non agricultural employees. So, how sing it up here? But I, we have water. So, what does not compare the actual amount paid by the employer? That's one of this five. And 